As we continue to break down the 2022 Fordham Rams, we move to the Rams up front, the offensive line. The good news for the Rams is that they returned four of the five starters from 2021, a line that helped Fordham lead the Patriot League and rank 11th in the NCAA in passing offense and lead the league in rank 12th in the NCAA in total offense. The lone loss from the 2021 offensive line is Nick Sakelj, an All-American and four-time All-Patriot League selection who was taken by San Francisco in the sixth round of the NFL Draft. Leading the returning starters is preseason All-Patriot League pick Phil Sala. The grad student, a four-year starter, played every game at right tackle last fall after serving as the starting center the previous two years. Other returning starters for the Rams are seniors Ryan Joyce, Lucas Portis, and Giovanni Patente. Joyce started all 11 games last year at right guard for the Rams, while Portis served as the starting left guard all season. Potente moved from guard to center last year where he started every contest. Other returning players with experience include seniors Nolan Oloya, who appeared in four games last year for the Rams, and Wyatt Claywitter, who saw action in two games in 2021, along with juniors Cody Johnson, who returns to the offensive line after seeing time on the defensive line last fall, and Patrick Barr. Sophomores David Evbomenia, who saw action in three games as a rookie last year, and Hank Perry, who played in two games as a freshman, also return. The offensive line welcomes a number of newcomers in 2022, including freshman John Michael Talanges, a product of Loyola Academy in Illinois, Duke Leonard from Cypress Hills High School in Houston, Kevin Laughlin, who hails from nearby St. Joseph's High School in Montvale, New Jersey, Thomas Fishback, a graduate of Winchester High School in Winchester, Massachusetts, Mike Smallenberger, who hails from Concord, California, where he played at De La Salle High School, and Kurt Plankins, who played high school football at St. John's Prep in Danvers, Massachusetts. Hey, so Phil, how's uh, camping going so far? Camp's been good, going good, you know. We're getting better every day, coming out with good energy, both offense and defense. And, you know, offense, you know, we're really trying to trying to get a lot better than we were last year. You know, every day, you know, new day, new route. I noticed after practice you stick around and, and went over some more plays with the guys. Is that something that, as a captain, you've, you've taken that responsibility? Yeah, ab absolutely. You know, try to get, you know, even if it's just a couple reps, you know, reps, you know, if you get five kick sets, you know, at the end of the day, you know, after 20 days, that's, what, 100 kick sets? So, you know, it, every rep, you know, matters. So, you know, even if you stay extra, do a little bit, you know, that's what I try to get the guys to do. Now you got four starters back from last year, and most of them are multi-year starters. How important is that for an offensive line to have that kind of uh, continuity? Yeah, no, it's great. You know, I mean, even on the leadership aspect, you know, not just me, but you know, I have Ryan, Lucas, you know, Gio, a lot of experience. So, you know, we we kind of hold the standard of the line. You know, we're just trying to every day kind of like gel. You know, we played a lot of ball together, so we kind of have a good feel for each other, and we're trying to get better with that. You know, so whole offense is really on the same page.